Hello, my Marvel maniacs. Hi, it's Colette Cherry. Nice to meet you if you're new here. We're watching Thor, Love and Thunder. I assume there's gonna be a lot of love in this movie. Ooh, <laughs> I saw Jane is back and she's looking buff. She looks like she's a female version of Thor. That's gonna be cool to see. I hope that there's some romance. Since love is in the title, there's a 99.999% chance that this will have love and romance, which I love to see in my movies. Maybe some kids scene, holding hands, hugging. Yes, maybe they'll have a baby together. Oh, that would be cool. A baby Thor. Ooh, I'm getting way ahead of myself. Somebody's carrying a child. A very big-headed man. <laughs> I was right. He's got a big pointy bald head. That guy looks familiar. Wait a minute. Is that who I think it is? We pray to you for water. My daughter. So they're basically gonna die of thirst. Oh no. Did I, did she die? Wait a minute. Is that Christian Bale? What is it, what are you doing? Mr. American Psycho, okay. So the daughter is dead, dead. They are not starting the movie off with the child dying. Bold, bold. Oh my gosh, he buried her. I'm in denial they just started the movie off like that. Voices are whispering. Is he seeing this as a mirage or is this really happening? Because he's, you know, he's not drinking water. That is Christian mother frickin' bail. So they're gonna get him at this very desperate point. Of course, they're gonna be like, do my bidding for me, Christian Bell. <gasps> oh, we found water. <sighs> but this is how they're gonna get him to do their bidding because they like gave him water, they saved his life. His skin? Ah, what do we have here? Uh, I know a flight. Oh, it's one of mine. <laughs> oh, that's the god he was praying to. I am Gore, the last of your disciples. Gore? We have lost everything. <laughs> Not Thor, but Gore, baby. Gore with a G. But our faith in you Aww. never wavered, and now we await the promise of the Aww. eternal reward. It's so sad. Do you think that he lost weight for this role? Like he purposely looks malnourished or are they just doing that? Cause like, look how tiny and skinny he looks. I feel bad for him. Knowing Christian Bale, he probably did it for the role. <laughs> he, he thinks there's an eternal reward. <laughs> <laughs> They're laughing at him. No, no, sorry. There's no eternal reward for you, dog. Dog, that guy just, through the fruit at my man's head. <laughs> He's being saved by his God, or so he thinks he is. Just pouring his heart out and the God just chucks a freaking papaya at his head. Look at that sadness. Look how disappointed he is. We just vanquished the holder of the Necro Sword. The Necro Sword. There's no one left to worship you. There'll be more followers to replace you. <laughs> there always are. We have suffered. He doesn't care. And we have starved. Does he look like he cares? My daughter died. Suffering for your gods is your only purpose. <laughs> There's nothing for you after death. I hate this god. You are no god. Thank you. Stand up to him. Yeah. Rip it off. I renounce you. That was a Christian Bale line right there. That's where I really recognized him right there. Yeah, you should be renounced. You're one of the biggest dickhead mother frickin' gods I've ever seen. Now your meaningless life. Somebody do something. Does have a purpose. Don't kill him. Sacrifice yourself to me. <gasps> is it the sword that's calling out to him? Yeah, it is. Yes! Summon the life 
So it's the necro sword that was calling out to him. That's the voice he heard. It's like trying to find someone to carry on the will of whoever just got killed. And it's telling him to kill all the gods. Oh, this is spicy. Oh, through the jugular. Man, got him good. Yeah, who's the god now, Biatch? Oh, chose you. You are now cursed. He didn't look cursed. It doesn't feel like a curse. It feels like a promise. He's oh. bleeding gold. What a cheesy god. My vow. He looks really different, too. All gods will die. <gasps> All gods will die. That's what the sword told him. Come gather round and listen to the legend of the Space Viking, aka Thor Odinson. <laughs> what is Quark doing reading to a bunch of kids? I love Quark. Oh my god, his boots, his furry boots are all so cool. Can we please get Thor back? Like, give me the good old days. Raised in the way of the warrior, Thor was taught to help oh! win battle. Is that him as a baby? <laughs> what is this song? He I grew, love it. And he grew. Loving nature did not discriminate. Oh, wow. Of the wolf woman on a woman wolf. <laughs> We're getting his whole backstory, including his romantic partners, Thor. Oh! One true love was an earth woman named Jane Fonda. Oh, wait, no. Jane Foster. Fonda? <laughs> Jane Fonda's an actor. But sadly, in the battle for love, Thor lost. Ooh. Yeah, she dumped him. That it was, seemed that, that everything harsh. and everyone he loved, he lost. And so he hid his heart behind a big fleshy bond <laughs> so it could never be broken again. The hand in the pants is always so great. Classic dad bod. Really drunk Thor. He teamed up with the Guardians of the Galaxy. Yes! And set off on some classic Thor That's how it ended for him. He got in shape. Heck yeah, he did. Turning pains into gains and never pains skipping leg day. Korg is the best narrator. He went from dad bod to god bod. But beneath his god bod, Wait, there was so still good. a sad bod just trying to get out. He's still suffering inside. So he gave up his search for love. Thor, I'm sorry. You're a sensitive boy. We need your help to win this battle. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Okay. I love that he's teamed Come up on. with the Guardians of the Galaxy. That is such a great combination of people. See Wait, what? Did he just... Is Thor on a freaking broom? Is he about to ride on the broom like a witch? No, he did not. He did not. Stormbreaker? What is he doing all Harry Pottery? What is he? The wizard Thor. That is unacceptable. I guess he lost his hammer. Finally joined our fight. <laughs> hey, blue people. As you know, we used to live in a peaceful oasis. Oasis. And now our sacred temple has been left unguarded and he desecrates. Not for long. Oh. Here comes. This. <gasps> you just got shot at. Wait, is this their performance that they put on? They got a show prepared? Can we talk about his outfit too? He's got this red vest on, this rock and roll like look to him. What? Oh, he's a performer now. He's putting on a show. Absolutely amazing with the song too. This is like very video game like Stormbreaker. Let's go. It has the same power as his hammer. You know what? Actually, we learned. We did learn this. Odin mentioned it. He doesn't get his power from the hammer. It's just a tool to use his power. The red leather vest is nice touch. Dude's flexible. Look, he got back in shape. He didn't hold back. He's like, I'm gonna know the splits, I'm gonna be a ballerina, and I'm gonna be macho. Ah! Ah! <laughs> this is this 
doesn't feel real. This feels like a giant SNL skit, and I'm waiting for the movie to start. <laughs> Oh, he just went through it. Is he gonna topple down? Or is he gonna stay Welcome standing? Everybody. Use our hearts and our minds to defeat the enemy with minimal loss or damage. It's down. It's down. What a classic forward venture. Hurrah! He doesn't need no hammer. He's got Stormbreaker that he rides. It's a weird, guys. Still warming up to that. Hi, Jane. Is she sick? It's awkward. So, how's, uh, how's it going? It's going amazing. Was that a lie? Jane, it's stage four. I have, like, how many stages? Four. Yeah. That we know about. She's in denial. It's normal. Viking myths. She's gonna reach out to Thor and he's gonna help. Health. You get your health back. You just gotta reach out to him. Smell like a king because you're worthy. Hello. Gotta make that money, you know. Gotta pay rent. I get it. Is that a flying boat? Oh, there's multiple flying boats. Cool. We're here to take you on. Yes. <laughs> okay, Matt Damon is playing Loki again. <laughs> Asgard is not a planet, my sons. It is people. It is you. And now it is time oh, for me. To he's gonna cry. <laughs> I'm disappearing. <laughs> They're throwing. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. Great, great job. There's Hella. <laughs> Melissa McCarthy's so funny. Mjolnir! Mjolnir! <laughs> Impossible! Who are these people that are coming to see this play? This is a tourist attraction. People pay for that. They pay their money. She needs that. Wait, how does she get that power though? That's what I don't get. How does she have the power to be a god, guys? In return for your service, please accept these gifts. This <laughs> tradition protect us of our world are bestowed with great beasts. <laughs> Some goats that scream? Oh, they are wonderful. Oh, look at that. Why do they have human <laughs> screams? King Yakan, thank you so much. I'm glad he likes his gift. They are beautiful. They also scream quite a lot. Uh-huh. <laughs> the damn remote so we can download the distress <laughs> Wait, what? He's got them on the ship? Why are they on the ship? <laughs> oh, she actually meant it. She was about to do it. Nebula's trying to kill them. All right, everything funny. Just relax. The goats are going to be fine. If not, we can just get some meat. They people. recognize that. They're a great conversation starter. <laughs> and they know that word. You summon them with a special whistle. He does something like this. No, that's not it. You have a go. <laughs> what did she just do? Glenda, we're married. <laughs> that's your Let wife? tell you about jumping into new relationships. Then I shouldn't be doing that. Yeah, you can't get married on every single planet we land on. Yeah. Oh, he does that often? Help us. The God Butcher has found us. God Butcher. It's a warning. <gasps> That's a door. Sif? We need you here. Oh, my friend is in danger. We must go at once. I don't know. Maybe we should split up. There's so many people to save. I mean, he's bummed at that idea. He doesn't want to split up, does he? After thousands of years of living, you don't seem to know who the hell you are. No. I've been lost before. But then Poor I found Thor. meaning. I found love. And yeah, I got taken from me. And God, that hurts. Mm. Gamora. That shitty feeling is better than feeling empty. That's a good line. Thanks, buddy. My hope for buddy. you is that one day you it's will deep. find something to make you feel this shitty. Weird way of saying it, but true. Either die a grismal death or they dump you with a handwritten letter. I don't know which is worse, but it's why I keep everyone at arm's length. Until Jane comes back. You answer the other calls. The galaxy needs its guardians. Cool, yeah, we were just leaving. Oh, I know it hurts. I know it hurts. He's so dramatic. Take this ship here as a parting farewell gift. 
Really? Oh, you're giving me my ship? Yes, she's yours. May you make as many <laughs> memories with her as I have. <laughs> it's his to begin with. Human handshake. It's the Asgardian shake. Into the snake that you cannot trust. Ow. Let's go. <laughs> Take care of my crew. This is gonna be hard for them. Hurry up! Not her. No, not Nebula. You ever feel lost? Just look into the eyes of the people that you love. They'll tell you exactly who you are. Love. He's not looking in Thor's eyes. Not you, Thor. He avoided that so much. Not you. Look, he's got Korg in the goats. You know, it could be worse. Totally. He doesn't care. He's out. He did not give him one hug. He did not shed one tear. He's happy to leave him have his ship back. He likes to be the alpha, okay? He does. Thor is too alpha for him. Stormbreaker! Get up, you freaking crazy axe. It is a crazy axe. Oh, that's better. Hell yeah. I like their fur. <laughs> they both have fur on, guys. Hold on. What is this outfit? It's pants. At least he's wearing pants. Good for him for trying to be fashionable even though he's a giant rock. So what do we do now, bro? Let's go get Sif. Bro. <laughs> Are the goats gonna scream this whole movie? Gosh, I hope so. Who or what is that? Falagar. What? God of the Falagarians. It's been slain. Oh, I hate to break it to you, but for a warrior to get into battle, yeah. you have to die in the battle. You survived. Yeah, that doesn't work that way. Maybe your arm is in Valhalla. What happened here? And she's like, save me! The God Butcher is coming. He seeks the extinction of the gods. Asgard is next. Yep, and you're next. He's gonna come for you, Thor. And there's Gore, looking like a dead zombie nun walking in the night. What are these children got to do with anything? <gasps> Oh, he looks so terrifying. It's just, what, what are they lighting the whole town on fire? Oh, heck yeah, Valkyrie's here. You're happy to see, yeah, he is, because it's another god that he can kill. <laughs> Oh, that's efficient. Look, it works just as good as the hammer. Who needs the hammer when you got the axe? There's a new guy. That guy? You're gonna love that guy. There's a new guy? Who's got the power of Thor? What is that? Is That's his hammer. Who's controlling the hammer? Mjolnir! It's me! Mjolnir! I'm seeing my hammer! We only hit one. Oh my gosh, is it Jane? It's Jane. That's the reunion they're gonna get. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. It's not gonna go to him, it's not. <laughs> Jane, that's totally her. Uh oh. We got some competition. Look at her winding that up. Look at her owning that weapon. She is so cool. I like this. She knows what she's doing. That's my hammy she looks like she's cured from cancer. And that's my look. Does he not know it's her? He might not recognize her because she's like big and bulky. Hey! Wait till he sees it's her. You take up that mask and reveal yourself. Come on. Oh, just wait. Hey. Jane? Aww. Let me tell you the legend of Thor and Jane. Nice reunion, huh? He was a god of thunder and she a woman of science. So teeny tiny, now she's like his height. And Jane taught Thor the way of the people. Halloween. 
Is he dressed up as a hot dog? Look how tiny she is compared to him. She's incredible, isn't she? Be on that. He's talking to his hammer like it's. <laughs> I need you to promise me you'll always protect her. And I love you too, buddy. Yeah, I think I think the hammer took that to heart. As a way of becoming magical. <gasps> oh, that's literally how it works. He set it and then the hammer engraved it into it's magic. That's what he wished the hammer to do, and the hammer did it because he said so. Oh my gosh. So they built walls between them. Thor got busy saving humanity. Nick is calling him. And eventually the space between them grew and grew Aww. until it became too wide to bear. Shame. Are they gonna rekindle their love in this movie? I'm down with it. I need romance in my movies. To stay up all night well, really, to I'm, go through this data. Okay? I have to stay up all night and, and clean all of this up. There's two the plates! <laughs> They're fighting over dishes. Jane wrote a note. And Thor read that note. Yeah, that was sad. And their legend suddenly became myth. Or so they thought. Until now. Look how tall she is. To feel Don't pass out. Don't, Don't pass out. The helmet. Yeah. Oh, he's okay. He's okay. There's a fire. He's hot, right? It's natural. Can we talk about this later? Natural. Yeah, maybe later after the fight. I feel like this is an opportunity for Jane and him to get back together though, so I'm not, I don't wanna let my hopes up, but I would love that. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> Why is he dressed like that specifically? It's so funny to me. Christian Bale's giving me Voldemort energy, his character Gore. I mean, no, this is going to hurt. Hurt. Ready? Don't touch my things. Mm, he's pissed about it. He's not gonna be able to defeat Thor. Maybe he'll, you know, he'll join him. Who knows? Just kidding. He looks pretty evil. Yeah, uh, you better run, you coward. He did run, but he's going into this child's room, actually. What do you want with this kid? That's every kid's biggest thing. Literally so scary. <gasps> These kids are gonna need a lot of therapy, you know? He put him in a cage. Oh, we, they missed. All the kids are gone? That's bad. It's not a good look. You didn't save the kids. <laughs> I'm still not used to that. Did you see that landing that Jane just had? <laughs> Quite a reunion, huh? Yeah, it is. What's it been like? Three, four years? <laughs> Eight years, seven months, and six days. Not that it matters. Like, no. who's keeping track? Uh, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I suppose we both left and both got left. They're both keeping track of different things. So that's the ex-girlfriend, is it? The old ex-girlfriend. Jodie Foster. <laughs> Jodie Foster. And your ex-hammer hanging out and getting on so well. Oh, Korg. Yeah. What you up it, to, bro? It doesn't want to come back to him. Go to daddy. Daddy. No, no, no. no it doesn't want to. Hey, there you are. Is that one getting jealous? I was just calling you. The axe, it's like, me? You're my daddy? You want the kids back? I'll be back in a minute. He's off to, I don't know what. Oh, bad landing. Slowly corrupts and kills whoever wields it, which means- Oh, so it infected him. It's infecting him, yes, must be. Of course. I think he likes it though. Dora likes being infected by the sword. Can you see me? Uh, floating head alert. It's Astrid. Heimdall's son. <gasps> Astrid! Oh, Heimdall's son. Your father taught me and I'm gonna teach you. I need you to focus and hold out your hand. You're good. Now focus. Korg, not you. <gasps> oh, he's with all the children. Oh, and the vision ghost. Look. 
Oh. What will happen to us? I can tell. This is a very, very bad situation. Don't tell that to children, Thor. So if you die, you'll end up in Valhalla. Oh my god, go away. Thor, that's the worst thing to say to scared kids. I'll see you soon. All right, that's what get me out of here. They're in the Shadow Realm. Oh. How do you know? He just left the kids. This is if color fears to tread. It's unmistakable. Well, then, if it's color we need, let's bring the rainbow. She looks buff. Good job. She got strong for this. We need reinforcements. We must raise an army. Are you thinking what I think you're thinking? I'm thinking it. What are we thinking? Thinking what? Thinking it too. Omnipotency. Omnipotency. It's the home of the most powerful gods in the universe. We could pull together the greatest team ever. And Zeus, the oldest and wisest of them all. Yes, Zeus. You think my god will be the ninny of the nonny? <laughs> no, you never know, Cole, but if they are, we'll ask them to join our team. Yes. Stormbreak. Jane's excited that they get to go meet all the, the gods. All these myths are true. Oh, you moved on quick, didn't you? <laughs> you got some piece of work. <laughs> you moved on quick. He's so feeling betrayed. Like, think about it. His hammer left him. His woman left him. But the hammer left him for the woman that left him. Ugh. It's hurtful. <sighs> Just checking. Oh, he misses it. She should let him have it. Kind of sad. What? The axe is always looking. He's so jealous. Jane, are you okay? Oh my gosh, she looks so sick. <sighs> is she healed? From cancer? Is that what it was trying to show us? That like the cancer's still there? Part of her's still there? Yeah. You think I really should be coming? I'm not getting any better. You're a Thor, of course you should come. You are a Thor. It means you pretty much have to die in battle. It needs to be devastatingly <gasps> painful. Otherwise you don't get into Valhalla. Yeah. I love being king. I love my people, but it's all meetings in Raven Mail. The meetings, it could have been Raven Mail. I like that she's the king. That's badass. Okay, we should go. Hmm. You packed? Are you packed? I would love to see the six inch platforms that Natalie Portman is wearing right now to make her appear tall. She is so tiny. It's so weird to see her like this. Yes, children. bring the children back. So it's the children, the children of Asgard. And then we shall feast. Hold on the children. <laughs> do not do that anymore. <gasps> dark times, shameful times. Shameful, what? That's so, uh, they used to do that? He just slid that under the rug. Like we used to eat the children, no biggie. Anyways. The goats are leading the ship, screaming the whole dang way. I'm never gonna get those shrill screams out of my head, but I love it. What is this world? There's tension between them. What about if I had like a cool catchphrase, like eat this hammer, bang, or like check out my hammer, bang. Oh, eat my hammer. So you got a girlfriend? Oh, no, no, <laughs> too busy, don't have time, you know, just work and everything. Huh? Cool. Yeah, she just wanted to know. I think she really likes him actually deep down. I knew a little girl just like you and she was brave and she was smart. Oh no, come on. About gods, they're meant to protect you, right? Well, where are they? Thor is on his way. Yeah, Thor's coming. Yes, I'm counting on that. He's a good villain though. I really buy him as this cursed guy, you know? They're the cloaks of emotion gods. Every color signifies different emotion. Oh. Well, kids, this is where the most Powerful creative gods and universe hang out. They hang out? Shouldn't they be doing god things? Oh yeah, that's Bao, god of dumplings. Psst, hey Bao. <laughs> hey Bao. Oh, ninny of the nonny. Hey ninny nonny. That's related to Korg, 100%. I see that he is a rock god. Look at his scissors. What is he on a, a chair of scissors? Is that... Meaning something or just random? They're like, we're gonna make him sit on a throne of scissors. That's probably just random. <laughs> Give me the Zeus! 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 Yes, this is theatrical. Okay. So dramatic. 
That's Zeus. Is that Russell Crowe? <laughs> the gladiator is Zeus, guys. Oh, I don't know if you know this, but I base a lot of what I do on this guy. He's the god of lightning, I'm the god of thunder. Huge source of inspiration. Oh, yeah? You should lead with that when you ask him for an army. Yes, lead with that. We can't interrupt him in the middle of an entrance. He's famous for his entrances. Yeah, he's got to perform first, you know, doing god things. <laughs> he tried to catch it. They're cheering him on like they're at a football game. <laughs> Woo! Did you see who's on his little throne with him? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven women. You know Zeus, he's probably partying a little too hard. I like that they're bringing in the other mythical gods. It's cool. I hear my own. Heart player. This holy council of the God. Of the God. First to say it is an honor and a privilege to be no, here. No, I can't hear you. Why don't you take the stage? Down there? Well, yes, you see the area that looks very much like a stage. Take the stage. I like how he just like asked Thor immediately to come down and talk to him. There's a maniac called the God Butchers. We can crush him before he kills anyone else. That guy, he killed a couple of low level God. Low level? That's all. Pretty boy. You go back to your seat and you be quiet. <laughs> Zeus is kind of rude. Now you chat up. You be quiet because you are this close to being uninvited to the orgy. I don't think he wants to go to the orgy. You cannot come to the orgy. <laughs> no and flicker. Ah! He's naked. It's too hard, damn it. Wait a minute, we gotta see these tats. I paused at the perfect time. R.I.P. Loki, brothers. Oh, that's Loki's helmet with the horns. And he's got a little scroll that says mother, Loki, Tony, Natasha, Heimdall, mother, father. Oh, that's so sweet. Got a little rose, a little moon, a little grave. <laughs> You flicked it too hard, damn it! You flicked it too hard! Should we help out? I mean, eventually. Great. Oh, she's enjoying the view? Take off their disguise too. Oh, no, 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 don't flick us. Let's go. Uh, don't flick us. <laughs> He's taken as guardian children. Who do you think we are? The god police? But he doesn't care. As guardian problems are as guardian problems. Yeah, they don't care. My hero, Zeus. See, afraid. I don't think he's afraid. He just wants to go to his orgy and party. He doesn't want to do work. <laughs> the way he just walked down the stairs. <laughs> Thor's body is one of the best bodies I've ever seen on a man. Panic is not good. We are safe here. You, my friend, you are safe here. He doesn't want to be safe here. Have some wine, have some grape. And come to the OG. Here, in Omnipotent City. Omnipotent City. Now I put your clothes back on. Flick, oh, flick. He's so ah, annoying. The Golden Temple of the God. Ugh, they're bummed about it. Did you see that reaction? Like, I'm sure those ladies would much rather have an orgy with Thor than this Zeus old man with the freaking curls in his hair. I need your lightning bolt. My lightning bolt is called Thunderbolt. Can I borrow? Borrow. He's gonna absolutely turn him down. He'd rather show it off for entertainment purposes. Like, he doesn't care about the Asgardian kids. This guy's a joke, kind of. Honestly, I'm learning a lot of the gods are jokes. No! Of course he said no. The god butcher. He will not reach eternity. Eternity? What? It's real? Eternity is a very powerful being at the center of the universe. It will grant the desire of the first person who reaches it. Yeah? What do you think a guy called the God Butcher would wish for? Oh yeah, true. If he got to the eternity, that would be really bad. God Butcher would be bad, bad, bad. Is this the purpose of the gods? 
They hide away in a golden palace like cowards. Maybe we have lost our way. Yeah, this is pathetic. You should be ashamed of yourself. The God Butcher could use you to find out. So what are we gonna do? This is no good. Kill him? Keep him captive? No. You must stay. Oh no. God! Hey! We do my plan now? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Oh, she did not hesitate to throw that hammer. Jane is ready to fight. Coming, guys. Yeah, we knew this was gonna happen. I just, I think he's surprised that Zeus sucks so much. He's kind of finding out what Gore is finding out about the gods. They're just very selfish and in their own world. They don't actually care about the people who worship them. They literally think people are created to worship them. And that's their only purpose, pathetic. That was that was a cool move. Way she looked up. No, no. Oh! <gasps> oh no, not Korg. No. I'm, I'm perishing. Oh no! Our little rock man, Korg. That was his bestie. He went right through Zeus. Gotcha! Oh, and he's dead now? Wow, Thor. He just threw it right back at him. Well, you killed his best friend. Thor, I'm down here. Where are you? Korg. Here I am. Oh! I didn't die. He didn't die. Turns out the only part of a cronin that's alive is his mouth. Corgi, listen, I need you to call the goats. I'll do my best. That's all that's left? Can we get his other rocks on him and make his body again? Or <laughs> is he just going to be a face? I'm glad they didn't get rid of Corgi. He's too cool. cool. I can do this, damn it. <laughs> come on, Corg, pass those. Come on, get the goats. <gasps> They're going to come in here screaming. <laughs> I love the goats. I did it! Ah! <laughs> yes, we got the lightning bolt. All right, this is the army right here. It's sleek, it's slender, it's powerful, it's beautiful. <laughs> uh, for you, I love it for you, Valkyrie. I mean, it's not really what I'm into because I've got my, my weapon out there. I'm not into it, sure. You your axe. Oh, there you are, old friend. <laughs> That was quite an entrance back there. Oh, he's gotta like warm it up. Uh. <laughs> Rub its ego. I think it's time for your first beer. What do you say? Oh. Wow, how sweet of you, Thor. Sorry, we've been fighting lately. <laughs> they liked it. Yeah, go out there, talk to your man. Give him a kiss. Space uh, dolphins. What? <clears throat> this, you should see them, space dolphins. Yeah. <laughs> it's so weird to see him that nervous around a girl. It's like a teen again. I want to feel shitty about something, and I think that's you. <laughs> Not really getting it. Star just... damn it. Oh my gosh, Star Lord told him to feel shitty about something. Like, that's so romantic. Bad phrase, bad phrase. But, but what do you say it? I want to live in the moment. I want to live like there's no tomorrow. Throw caution to the wind. I want, I want to be with you, Jane. Uh, what do you say? I have cancer. Oh, that's still a thing. So what? I'm sick. I thought she was gonna get cured. I don't have cancer. Let's go smash something. Jane, I'm so sorry. Oh. When did you find out? I thought she was being helped with that by the, uh, the hammer. I thought maybe mm. if science isn't working, maybe Viking space magic. Yeah. Well, that's why you came to New Asgard. Yeah, I thought the hammer maybe could cure me. That's what I thought. You taught me there was no greater purpose than to help those in need. Yeah. You made me worthy. Oh, so spend your last moments together. So whatever you want to do, we can do together. 
Yes. Now what do you want to do? I want to get those children back to their families. Yeah. Finish that mission. And then you guys should start a family. How are you feeling? Shitty. How oh, shitty? Aww. Really shitty. Kiss. Finally. Do you think those two will ever hold hands over a hot lava pool and make a Thor baby? Oh gosh, I hope so, please. It's unlikely, sadly. Mm, that's too bad. I think Thor <laughs> would make a great dad. Yeah, he would. Hey, we're here. They kissed for a bit. That's good. Hopefully more later. Where did the color go? The color goes in this place. That's how he recognized it. <laughs> oh, the poor goats. They're doing so much right now. Look, they know how to make an entrance. I wonder who they hired to be just the screamer of the goats. Like, who's the voice actor? Good job. Good job with the goat screaming. You just know Natalie Portman is wearing huge platform shoes. I like this black and white aspect. This is a cool concept. There's no color. Bifrost is the key. Oh, that's what he's gonna use. Oh, he's here with his creatures. And the trap! I want to see more of Gore. I want him to talk more. I like his backstory. Gonna tell me why you just threw Stormbreaker out the window? <laughs> he needs it to open the gates of eternity. Wait, I just realized this movie's called Love and Thunder because there's gonna be love. So much love. Maybe Jane and Thor do have a baby. Give me a baby. Voldemort, but creepier. <laughs> Oh my gosh. You really have to stop being like this. Call the axe. <laughs> call the axe when you call the dentist. <laughs> Come on, Thor. You can do this. In a stunt? Are you a Valkyrie? Yes. <laughs> How exciting. Valkyrie. He's excited. That was good acting right there. I like that. I like that switch. <laughs> he smiles so cynically there. It's like a little child. She's not really a god. You're dying. I'm sorry. We're on the same path. The way he caressed her. As the sword empowered me, the hammer empowered you. Sort of, yeah, similar. There is no eternal reward for us. He's still hung up on that. He's really feeling betrayed. He can't let it go. Now I understand. My daughter is the lucky one. She does not have to grow up in a world of suffering. That's one way to look at it. It's very cynical, but... Run, my wicked god. I like how they're really not rushing his moment. That's what I wanted. I was like, don't rush Gore. I want more of him. I want to hear more of him. I like that they're taking their time in this black and white realm. I like this. This is a good scene. Choose love. Go the axe. No! Oh. Go He's hurting Jane. The axe. He knows that he can use that against him. Yeah, he has to. Oh my gosh, it's just shattered. Imploded, it looked like. I want to kill this guy. So do I, but we have to take him alive. Why? We're only linked to finding those children. Mm, yeah, true. Maybe we'll have a change of heart in the end. Who knows? It's love and thunder. You. Me. Let's go. 
He doesn't look intimidating, but he is powerful. Gore looks like he's on the brink of death, but so malnourished and skinny. But the thing that's different between Gore and Thor is that Gore's power is derived from that sword. So if you get rid of the sword, he doesn't have his power. But with Thor, his power does not derive from his weapons. He is the God of Thunder. So in that sense, he can whoop his butt. All you have to do is get rid of the Necrosword. Oh, wait, why couldn't she pick it up there? Did you notice that? It dropped. <gasps> Don't kill Valkyrie. She did say she wanted to die in battle, but that's horrible. We gotta get her out of here. Yeah, she's she's not dead, but she's close. Okay, Jane is fine. Hey guys, we're here. Come on, let's go. <laughs> He's carrying Korg in his mouth. <laughs> Insane. Oh no. Something's affecting her body's ability to fight the cancer. What is it? He's gotta be able to do something. Oh. You're going without me? Uh, I don't think you're fit to go. He's gonna use uh, those kids to distract you. You need me. I do need you, Jane. You're so I sick. need you alive. Yeah. Because I love you. Aww. And this is a chance for us. If you pick up that damn hammer again, then her chance is gone. Yeah. Better come back to me. She, he, yeah. I, he will. He will. She's traumatized from the last time. I think I lost my kidney. Gone completely. Oh. I wish I could join you, but... Yikes, the kidney. You have to go alone. All you have to do is destroy that sword. Yeah, that's it. Simple. He is pretty powerful. I give it to Gore. But now he has the axe, so. We'll see, though. We gotta just destroy his necrosword. That's it. That's the key. Eternity. He made it to eternity, the center of the universe. He's shooting the Bifrost into it. So happy. He looks so cheerful there. Why do you have the kids with you? This is so unnecessary. Don't you like children? Did your child die? Like, why are you terrifying these poor kids? <gasps> it just landed on the kids. Oh. Hey, kids. I was thinking, did they just smush all the kids in the movie? That's horrible. No. No, kids. They just stop screaming. <laughs> just in time. Like what, Gore is so backwards. He wants to get rid of all the gods, destroy them, but also why hurt the kids if you love your daughter so much? I also feel like the Necrosword's curse energy has taken over his mind. They're behind me, aren't they? Yep. Quite a lot of them too. Does anyone here have battle experience? Well, They're so young. Whosoever holds these weapons believes in getting home if they be true of heart is therefore worthy and shall possess. Say it, Thor. Limited time only. <laughs> the power. Of Thor! Oh, that's so cool. He's just gonna give it to all the kids are about to go nuts. <gasps> the shape of the tree is really cool. I love that. Oh, they got the power of Zeus right now. Lead your army to that axe. <laughs> So work. cool. That's like a kid's biggest dream. They get to become like gods with the power of Thor and Zeus. <laughs> Imagine being a kid and getting to watch this in the theater. Like, that was me. That's, you'd be the coolest kid in school by far. Oh, the little girl's having fun. Is Jane gonna join the fight too? No freaking way. And does she feel him being hit? They're connected like that? She's gonna go. She's like, I know what I have to do. 
<gasps> Jane! Oh. Come on, you still got this, Thor. Look at him! He's a Voldemort looking freak with dirty teeth! You can whoop him! He's got a <laughs> Oh! It caught me off guard, but I like it. Yes. Yes. Oh, she's got a horse with wings. Right in Pegasus. Valkyrie's horse. She lent. She borrowed it. It's better than being in bed sick. Stormbreaker, stop this! Get Stormbreaker, get up! Come on! Listen to daddy! Daddy says to stop! You stop! What? Look, if Thor referred to himself as daddy around anyone, I think we would immediately buckle and fall to our knees, okay? It goes for men and women. First off, the <laughs> name is Mighty Thor! Yes! If you can't say Mighty Thor, I'll accept Dr. Jane. Buster! Yes, girl! Thirdly, eat my hammer! Oh, that's a line. She wanted to say that so badly this whole time. Yes, he listened. Oh, everybody's just able to use Thor, Thor's weapons. Remember, it was a whole thing in the Avengers and they couldn't lift the hammer. But turns out some people are worthy. A lot of people are worthy of his weapons. It's time for you to die, Gore. He's looking back at this woman. I love when it goes to a bunch of pieces and comes back. That's the coolest thing. She looks beat up. Oh, she's gonna wield the lightning. Yep, that's the final blow, that's it. Yeah, now the sword's gone. He doesn't have his power. That's the key. Jane? She used all her strength for that. Where is he going? You don't have your power anymore. He's going to eternity. This is eternity. Yeah, okay. It looks like the place where Thanos went after he snapped. Or he, no, after he got the soul stone. That's it. Looks just like it. Same place that Hawkeye went. Go stop! He looks different. I know your pain, but this isn't the way. It's not. Oh, Jane. You seek love. Love. Why should I seek love? Love and thunder. Because it's all any of us want. Mm -hmm. That's his motive. How dare you turn your back on me? I'm glad his teeth are back. <laughs> Not the black thing looking spiky teeth. It's better that it's nice. Nice veneers back. Good job. I choose love. You can too. You can bring her back. Yeah. Make your wish. Yeah, that's what you should choose. He gets the choice. Get your daughter back. That's what your motive is, right? Or maybe he'll choose for Jane's life to be saved instead because he's so moved by her dying and that feeling of holding someone you love as they're dying. That would be epic. But I think it would be cool if we got his daughter back. I don't want Jane to die. I'm dying. She would have no one. She would be alone. She won't be alone. Oh, She'll have them. What is he gonna wish? It's like a shape of a, a little girl right there. Somebody's walking up. That's her, the daughter. That was a cool reflection. Oh, 
she's all healthy looking too. I wonder what these markings on his skin are. Sad. Looks like scars. He's been through a lot of pain. I think I figured out my catchphrase. <laughs> what? Okay. Want to know what she said? Why didn't they tell us? Why didn't they just tell us? I love you. No, don't get rid of Jane. After he finally got the one he loved, Thor knows so much pain. They're gonna gold dust sizzle her out of here? Ugh. That's how the gods die, right? Wow, that says a lot. That's so sad. Why did he have to lose her? Protect my love. So that's his gonna be his daughter now? Really? So he's got a daughter. <laughs> but Jane, I'm so sad. The mighty Thor, AKA Dr. Jane Foster. Is that her statue in honor of her? And taught us all what it means to be worthy. Oh. She helped the children of the gods. That's so terrible. They can't do that. Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm okay. Are you sure? I'm okay. It was good. The kids got to be gods for a little. They're training. Especially after their king made them all go to self-defense classes. Yeah, that's good. Axel Handelson, who could now do his dad's freaky eye magic, was becoming quite the warrior. <laughs> There's Seth with her one arm. Speaking of futures, I was forging one of my own. Now that my body's grown back. Oh, yay, Korg. With a dude I met called Dwayne. Are you making a little baby? A little someone who turned him from sad His god daughter. into dad god. Dad god. <laughs> oh, there you go. Wait, that's so cute. Excuse me. What is that? She's reading the Jane Foster book. I don't think I like pen flaps. Oh, you will. Yes, you do. I've never had that in my life. You will. Trust me. Where are your boots? I'm wearing them. On the table. No, you're not. Go to hell, Steven! <gasps> is that his daughter in real life? Now, where is Mjolnir? Where'd I put it? Over there, sleeping in the bed. In the bed. He has a bed? Oh, wow. Wow. What did you do? Eh, he looked boring before. <laughs> yeah, I suppose it did. I love it. Yeah, he's got a face now. They look nice. Yeah, they are nice. That's why we have to look after them. Got it. Protect the nice one. Yeah. I love you, sweetie. Love you, Uncle Thor. Uncle Thor. It will always be there for us. The space Viking. She now wielding the axe. Eternity with the powers of a god. Eternity girl with the powers of a god. That's our next Marvel hero. Good fight for those who can't fight good. That's cute, them running together. Thor looks good as a dad. He really does. I just wish Jane was here. They are simply known as Love and Thunder. Love and Thunder. Oh, that's her name. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I get it. I get it. Oh, she's the eternity god of love. I love it, guys. They begged you for mercy mm. without ever knowing if you were actually listening. Okay, so he's alive and well being pampered by his orgy queens. They don't ask us for lightning. They don't ask us for rain. They don't care about the gods. They just want to see one of their so-called superheroes. Are you jealous? When did we become the joke? When you stopped caring. They will fear us again. When Thor Odinson falls from the sky. Do you understand me, Oculus? <gasps> Do you understand me, my son? Yes, father. Oh, that's Hercules. That's going to lead into the next movie, huh? Is Marvel going to get into the realm of Zeus and Hercules for real? She's Jane so pretty. Foster. Is this her life after Heimdall? death? Yeah, that's why Heimdall's there. Thank you for looking after my son. Aww. Very welcome here to the land of the gods. 
<gasps> Valhalla! Welcome to Valhalla. That's really cool. <laughs> Thor will return? They're gonna give us a fifth Thor? Oh gosh, he might be the only one who got that many movies. Doctor Strange? Charlize Theron. You caused an incursion. <gasps> oh, she's mad. Love her makeup. She looks incredible. Unless you're afraid. Yeah, no, he's not afraid. Not in the least. You got that third eye. So he's going to fight with her. What, who is she? Cool, I like the purple. Is Charlie Theron coming to the multiverse? Oh, Doctor Strange will return too. Ooh. This guy's still punching himself, shoot. Still his poor face. Yay! It's over! We were wondering about you, bro. I'm glad you're good. I'm glad you're much better now. All right, Thor, Love and Thunder. I loved it. I loved it. I don't know how the audience felt at the time it came out. I don't really know what people gave it for reviews, but I had a blast. I laughed. I teared up a little bit with Jane dying. It was beautiful. It is happy ending though. And he has a little girl now. I love that for Thor. So Thor is gonna be a daddy and we're gonna see him probably raise this girl. Maybe he'll be grown up with her. I'm so glad Thor will return. I want the variant of Loki to come join Thor. I don't know if that's possible, but we gotta make it happen.